This has turned into an epic fail and the black smoke bomb's not working either. Today I'm gonna to show you how you can spice up your Halloween display with fireworks. I'm gonna be testing out two different effects here today with smoke bombs and then these super hefty pro strobes, which I'm really excited to see. We have three different colors in here. And like I said, these are really packing some weight. So that should be a super awesome effect. And then we have four different colors of smoke tubes here. This should be a really awesome, visually pleasing effect. This is going to be what we're working with today. We have a giant pumpkin and then the Home Depot dancing witch animatronic that will turn on here in a second. This is gonna be a pretty cool looking backdrop for these effects. So we're gonna start with the smoke bombs and then once it gets darker, do those really awesome XL strobes. The animatronic is going nicely. We have the red smoke bomb here and we're gonna try this out. Here we go. And it's lit. Wind is carrying that nicely. You can see how cool of an effect that is. That is really awesome with the red smoke bomb. The red smoke bomb was a massive success. And now I've decided we're gonna switch things up a little bit and do two smoke bombs at once. Quite a fitting name here on the orange smoke. We have the Pyro Demon brand. We're gonna put the orange smoke inside the pumpkin and this black smoke by Hot Fireworks behind the witch and do two smoke bombs at once. So we got the black smoke hidden back here. Let's hit that one. And then real quick, get over here. And we got the orange one as well. Here we go. Oh, and that is catching on fire. Uh-oh. I don't think I did the best placement there. And the black smoke bomb's not working either. This has turned into an epic fail. Maybe don't use blow mold pumpkins and use <laughs> actual carved pumpkins instead. I'm gonna go ahead and get the hose on. Wicked Witch down. Oh goodness. Get a little bit on this. Ugh. Okay, we're good. Well, that wasn't great. Um, <laughs> Where do we start, guys? The black smoke bomb didn't even work in the first place. And then obviously that pumpkin got burnt pretty bad. My placement of the orange smoke bomb was not good. So if you're doing this trick, I would recommend doing it with carved actual pumpkins and not flammable materials like a plastic pumpkin so yeah lesson learned there but we're still gonna do the strobes with this at night so let's see how it does and yes the witch is okay it did survive that catastrophe that was just a fail all around i hope it entertained you guys at least quite an unfortunate day for our pumpkin here as he lost a tooth due to that flame but he's gonna be just fine and we're gonna try out these pro strobes inside of his mouth Hopefully it doesn't catch him on fire. I'm a little bit less concerned about these as I am the smoke bombs, because if you look, these are gonna be a lot easier to just place down in there, not have them facing sideways or anything like that. And they have a good amount of space to exit upwards and create their strobes and smoke. We'll see you when it gets dark. Witch is ready to go. Our buddy over here has had some better days with his teeth, but we're gonna try out the pro strobe. That was extremely bright. Now let's try the red variation. Where's the fuse at? There it is. Wow. That was a whole lot of fun. If you'd like to get some fireworks for yourself for this upcoming Halloween season, check the video on the screen right now where I review a new novelty fireworks website that ships to the entire continental United States. Thank you for watching and peace out.